What's going on YouTube? Today is a very exciting day today. I just received this in the mail. It's the Blue Lab Soil pH Pen. I'm a huge fan of Blue Lab and their products and as you know I already have the uh, PPM uh, pen as well as the regular pH pen. And this one is the soil pH pen where you can just take this and stick it into the soil and it will tell you the pH of the soil. So no more uh, measuring the drain off um, from your watering and it's more, uh, it's cleaner, it's faster, um, definitely a lot less messy. And um, really dig it. I'm looking forward to uh, really using this. And right now it is soaking in the in a just a cup of um, regular tap water. Uh, according to the instructions, I have to do that for 24 hours, and then I will calibrate it. Um, I guess I just need to stick the probe into the soil. Um, really excited to uh, use this for my girls. Um, as you all know, um, pH is really important for nutrient intake and um, to be accurate on that to get all the beneficial nutrients that the girls need for um, more medicine. As you know, the, the more nutrients that they take, um, the more medicine that you will, you will yield. So, um, so pH is very important, especially in the soil as well as the nutrient mix. And I'll actually be using this quite um, soon. Um, I've been away for eight days and the ladies have not been fed for eight days. I know that's quite a long time. Three out of the four plants actually can are doing well right now, but the one that I um, showed on my last video, the Eagle Cloud one, that is not doing well at all. Usually that really gets thirsty after four days and now it's eight and it's really drooping and also there's a, it looks like a nitrogen de uh, deficiency on that plant. I'll be showing you that as well. Um, so i um, looking forward to using this pen for that plant and hopefully I can get it um, healthy again. I'm not sure. We will try. I'll document that and I'll be making a compost tea as well. And I'll um, make a separate video on that one uh, for you all to view and take a look at. Um, regarding back to this pen, um, got it, like I said, from Green Trees Hydroponics in Vista, California. It actually retailed. Um, it's expensive. Um, I won't lie to you. It's, it's a lot of money compared to my other Blue Lab pens. Um, this pen costs one hundred and thirty-seven dollars and eighty-nine cents through Green Trees Hydroponics, and um, with shipping and tax, it equaled out to one fifty-three oh three. Yeah, that's a big chunk, but um, again, pH is quite important for the ladies and for your medicine to really get as much yield as you can. Um, and get as much medicine as you can. So pH is really important. I'm thinking this is quite worth it. So um, I will definitely try it out. I'll review it. Um, if you have any questions, please let me know. Just let me know if you have any questions regarding this pen. And I will answer them as best as I can. So um, we shall see how this product works. Um, is, if it's anything like my other Blue Lab pens, um, I think it'll work just fine. So um, peace out, YouTube. Thank you so much for uh, watching. And again, just let me know if you have any questions.